This is Steven. I'm a big fan of the Fight Mafia, and I'm a huge supporter of Noel Brooks. Um, and I don't like Nathan Quarry. He's the rock, and he's called that for a reason. Uh, everybody knows Nate's a, a, a D-bag, and he's probably not a very good person. I mean, he's, he's, he's a good fighter, and I hear he's a good dad, but other than that, he's, you know, whatever. And I'm tired of him um, slamming on what the Fight Muffins have been doing to support him. So I went and got um, my recycling, and I got my change jar, and I'm, I'm putting together some funds to help out uh, Noel and the fight muffin. So far I, I think I have about 38 cents and um, so in just a matter of time you know we'll be able to to help uh, settle this issue for all. I was going to drive around when I was filming this but um, I couldn't because I don't have a car and uh, I couldn't I couldn't get a big gulp either so I just made um, a special drink from the kitchen. My, my throat broke. I can tell you firsthand what a D-bag uh, Nathan, Nathan the Rock Corey is because back in the day he was my paper boy. Um, well, he was my parents' paper boy. And, uh, you know, he got a lot of exercise and training by riding that bike around. And to get snotty over not viewing that as a way for him to better himself as a fighter was just not right. And he used to pound on our door, begging for his, his little money every day. I think it was like once a month that kid came around. You know, where's my money? Where's, you gotta pay me. Instead of just looking at it as the way that he was building the, the legs of a future fighter. That's what he should have been doing, but he wasn't. He was just a D-bag, you know, complaining. I think he was like 12. Who's that? Let's go find out. Four weeks, 20 papers, that's two dollars. She made, I don't have a dime, sorry. Didn't ask for a dime, two dollars, plus tip. Uh, my little brother got his arm stuck in the microwave, so my mom had to take him to the hospital. Uh, my grandmother dropped acid this morning and she freaked out. She hijacked a busload of penguins, so it's sort of a family crisis by 